Prime Minister Rishi Sunak has been fined for not wearing a seat belt in a moving car while filming a social media video. With this, Sunak has become the second sitting Prime Minister in history to be fined by the police after he received a fixed penalty notice for not wearing his seat belt. This is the second time in the last 12 months that Sunak has been fined by the police. Earlier, he was punished by the Metropolitan Police for attending Downing Street parties during lockdown. Boris Johnson also received a fine at that time, which made him the first sitting Prime Minister to be penalised for breaking the law. Following the circulation of a video on social media showing an individual failing to wear a seat belt while a passenger in a moving car in Lancashire, we have today issued a 42-year-old man from London with a conditional offer of fixed penalty. Lancashire Police said on Twitter, A number 10 spokesperson said, The Prime Minister fully accepts this was a mistake and has apologised. He will of course comply with the fixed penalty. The police did not say how much they had fined the Prime Minister, but according to the government's safety campaign, any driver or passenger not wearing a seat belt is breaking the law and is liable to be fined up to 500 euros. The video to promote the government's latest round of levelling up spending was posted on Mr. Sunak's Instagram account and was deleted later. In the video, Sunak turns to the camera without his belt on to talk about the government's levelling up agenda. The car was being accompanied by the police outriders as the Prime Minister travelled from one event to another. Labour said that the incident made Sunak a laughing stock. A party spokesperson said hapless Rishi Sunak's levelling up photo op has blown up in his face and turned him into a laughing stock. The fine caps a tough week for Sunak who travelled to Northern England this week to publicise millions of pounds worth of grants that the government announced from its levelling up fund. The visit was meant to showcase Sunak's ability to connect with ordinary voters and to reset the government agenda after a bruising six months. It was overshadowed, however, not only by the controversy over his seat belt, but by the revelation that he had travelled to Blackpool in a 14-seat RAF jet. Fixed penalty notices are a sanction for breaking the law and means a fine, which needs to be paid within 28 days or contested. If someone chooses to contest the fine, the police will then review the case and decide whether to withdraw the fine or take the matter to court. Labour's deputy leader Angela Rayner said in a tweet that Mr Sunak was a total liability.